Hello, it's Wednesday, February 24th, 2010, and I'm Martin Smith with a daily outlook from Maxiforex. The dollar gained versus the other majors after disappointing consumer confidence again raised risk aversion. CB consumer confidence came out weaker with 46 versus 55 forecast. Crude declined by minus 1.81%, closing at $78.86 a barrel. Crude inventories are expected with 1.8 million versus 3.1 million prior. Gold also weakened by minus 0.89%, closing at $1,102.07 an ounce. Today, new home sales are expected higher with 354,000 versus 342,000 prior. Fed Chairman Bernanke will testify in Washington on the semi-annual monetary policy. The euro dropped after German IFO business climate declined for the first time in 11 months, coming out at 95.2 versus 96.2 expected. Chancellor Angela Merkel criticized recent speculations against the euro. The euro dollar has failed to remain above the 136.50 resistance level, and a continuance of the main downtrend below 135 is likely. The pound continues its downward trend, sliding lower after weaker BBA mortgage approvals and weak economic data from the US triggered a flight to safety. BBA mortgage approvals came out lower with 35.1 thousand versus 45.3 thousand expected. However, the yen gained versus all of the 16 majors after weaker consumer confidence in the US boosted the appeal for the safety of the yen. The dollar-yen turned downwards after it failed to break above its daily 200 moving average. The pair has two important support areas, 90 and 89.50. Both are likely to slow its downtrend. The Canadian dollar dropped versus the American dollar as stock markets declined and higher yielding assets demanded lo demand lowered on slower economic recovery. The dollar CAD crossed above daily moving averages 50 and 100 and is heading upwards towards the next resistance at 106. That's it from me. Be sure to visit us at maxiforex.ru.